hi it's Sarah and I've come to again with to show you another journal that I have made these are just things I've collected to do with mushrooms and fungi I think they've got such a magical element to them when I'm out and about I take loads of photos and I pop them in this journal and I write where I find them and a little about the actual mushroom after I've looked them up so it has a little dangle with some buttons and little vials and just little odds and ends and some little mushrooms there that I did with shrink plastic and I've just collected these pictures over the years they've come from various books and different things and I love the title of this book <laughs> The Binding a little mushroom there and I kept the back because I thought it was so lovely and I didn't want to cover both sides so inside I kept the front two pages of the actual original book because I thought they were nice there's a little pocket there I did get some of these little pictures and things downloaded um, bought off Etsy but the majority of them have come from books and pictures that I've taken myself like this one here I took myself this I've took myself just whilst I'm taking the little pooch for a walk see these things and I just take photos of them and here I've done like a little what do you call them a little roll thing that one's not one of my pictures, that's just a picture that I've collected. And yeah, these are pictures I've taken myself and little bits that I've written about. Just a little poem there about strolling through the woods. And here I've did a watercolour of a mushroom. I did a nice collage with it. Tags. Oh no, that's the dangerous one. The green cap. A bit of a doodle on the back of that one. I've taken that one, that was in the local park. And then I have a pocket here with another little card to write on. And another little there's another little pocket this is from Artie Mates it's a free download on our Facebook page or on a Who website you can get those ones there's some more that I've taken tree fungus that's a nice big tag there Drew that and um, embossed with embossing powder on the top of it, and the back of it is embossed slug tape that you can pick up pound stores and places like that. There's another picture that's of a mushroom that I found in the local park. A little bit about it on the back there. More mushrooms are taken. I just took these ones on Saturday on a family trip out to a local place where I live called Jasmine Dean. So we'll pop it on the top. It's just something magical about them. And a lot of them are probably don't taste very nice and could probably make you really ill, but 
masuk M on zone sari. That one's on a tree stump in the local park. Every time I go, it's been either kicked down and then it's grown differently. Really bizarre. And there's another little collage I did with a watercolour. Let's put the chart up. Took that one too. And that one. Love that one. It was huge. Took that one last year when we went to Durham and stayed in a little cottage. And when I took that on a little walk, it was fab. That's just a little about that one. from this some coffee stone paper I did there it's like a little collage with a picture I took there I think I took those ones oh yeah in Durham too and that one that one was taken in Durham as well It was so pretty, it was very delicate. And these ones I took myself and then I just edit them on an app on my phone to make them look like a watercolour. That's just an empty pocket there. book pages took another one there and this year when I take my pictures and I, I store them in there until I'm ready to use them and then another one there is one stored in there that I've taken to pop it in somewhere and I've made this like a little tuck spot not written anything in yet This one, shrimp plastic mushroom. And another one of those ones I did on the app. There's another empty pocket there. And then on the back here, we'll have this picture. And that. I'm just tell them when I started the journal. And this bit here, funny enough, is packaging of Richmond's meat free sausages. I just thought it was great, so I just cut it off and used it, put a magnet in. Lovely little uh, hidey bit there. And that's my mushrooms and fungi. Oh, and we have this bit here, it's the bookmark. Thank you. Till next time, bye bye.